Yeah, it's a little bit better. Maybe I'll make this a shorter video, a really short video. Because, uh... What happened? I went out Friday for the opener. Uh, around 8 o'clock I had a doe come through. Something spooked her, probably me. Uh, she took off running when I was trying to adjust the saddle. So, uh, maybe I'll be better. You probably can't hear over the rain anyway. Uh, so anyway, um, yeah, I had that doe take off running. She what? She didn't blow. She wasn't too startled. She just didn't like what she saw up in the tree. Uh, but she ran about 30 yards, stopped, flicked tail, and started walking off. And then at about 9 o'clock I had a buck come through, which I still haven't checked the footage. I tried turning the camera on and zooming in that area, but it was dark. I mean, it was 9 o'clock, so, but the sun wasn't really up, up. There was an overcast. Um... Plus it was foggy, so there's a lot of fog in there, and I just saw this all these tines coming through uh, So I figured I'd come back today While walking in I saw a coyote on the trail. I was like great I hope there wasn't like a lot of them but Whatever so saw the coyote on the trail it took off running into the woods just same path where I was expecting that deer to come through. I, I loop around to my spot, got set up, and uh, I heard more coyotes howling at around 8 o'clock. The, uh, I don't know if the audio on the camera picked that up, but there's a deer blowing. Fifty yards to my what would that be? My west, southwest. Uh, so it was upwind to me. So it wasn't for me. I don't know if it was like coyotes in the area still or whatever. I don't know. But it started blowing. Maybe it was the rain. Is it the rain? Because the rain started coming down really hard. I mean. It, it's fogging up but it was raining well drizzling kind of steady not too bad uh, I figured you know when it was 10 30 you know, that's enough grabbed all my stuff packed up and upon leaving I went down another trail just to see what's out there um, where that deer was blowing at there was another deer that was bedded down and when I was walking through the trail, there's a low spot that was filled with water. So I started walking through there. It jumped up, took off running. Like, ran like 20 yards and stopped. But then when I got to the end where I wanted to go, it just really started coming down. And I don't think there's a dry spot on me. So... That's it for the opening weekend uh, archery season here in Michigan. I hope you guys had better luck than I did. I think, like I said before, I'm going to take it easy for a couple more weeks and maybe towards the end of October I'll get out again once it starts getting colder and love starts getting in the air. Then uh get back after them. That's it. Now I'm going to get something to eat. Some dry clothes on. Bye.